G'day and welcome into part 10 of my campaign as the uh, remnants of Angmar, now the self-proclaimed kingdom of Angmar, in Divide and Conquer Total War, Mod from Evil 2. Uh, previously, we hit back at the backstabbing goblins. Zagkala, Bluenos took back all the cell sword and also took Goblin Town, which is amped up our economy significantly. So I'm very happy about that. Uh, we're now making about 10,000 a turn. Well, we're making 17,000, so I think we've been recruiting a few troops to wage war. Uh, the next step of the little goblin war is going to be a little trickier. Uh, they have marshaled their forces. So we have one, two, three, four, uh, and bits and pieces, like four and a half, maybe things I can't see, like five full stacks of goblins down here. There's yeah, some in here as well. So that is tricky. Particularly when we've only got really like one good yes. army here and then one kind of will, my lord. bits and pieces trash. I mean, they're not trash units. They're, they're okay. They're like tier one units mainly. But um, yeah, it's, it's not certainly not a strong force. An order. So that is what my we're lord. currently currently working with. Obviously, we still have the Dunedain and Brelanders working hard at uh, dislodging us along their borders. And they're sending armies. So we got one there, one here, another one here. In fact, I'm a little bit concerned about this. Um, I need to readjust how we spend some money this turn. I respect you, my enemy. Because they have dwarves. Welcome Entangled. They've gone the mercenary choice, Bree. And they've got Longbeard Crossbows, Longbeard Phalanx, Legion Shield Guard. Um, so they've gone the mercenary choice, and that's. Some pretty scary units there. Like my wraiths are good, or my, my barrow whites are good, but they're gonna get worn down if they gotta start chopping through that. Also, there's another whole stack of Dundine here. Um another I will only address half two thirds stack up here. So they they are around and about. What else could we get here? A Myron infantry? Yeah. Some orc fighters. Uh, we did queue up some siege. I don't think we're necessary to get all of this. I might just get the catapult. Ignore those two ballistics. They're pretty expensive. Yeah, the 1,100 a pop. So did we just spend that money immediately and not get what I wanted to build? Well, that was silly, wasn't it? Um, so I think I'd like to get as many of these lads in here as I can. Um... What's better? Six, seven, and seven? Four, six, and six. Yeah, the orc fighters are a bit better. We'll get those. Now, whatever it was just, just ate up our cash. Um, something we don't need this turn. Something just devoured our our money. What was it? Um, no, not that one. This one here. Okay. Uh, let's just cancel that. Get those. Um, that's a bit better. And we'll get that guard barracks going as well. That's okay. That's a little bit better, I think, because I think we want some want some troops here. Got the garrison here, didn't we? Yeah. So, three. Yeah, that's a bit better. Got those Barrowites retrained as well, so they're all good to go. Alright, and then we'll queue this one up for next turn. Right, I think that's a little bit better, just because there are two armies here, and there's only like the two thirds of an army there, so we'll go for the slightly more dangerous area, commit some more money in. Then, we also have the prospect of Gundabad maybe betraying us. I'm surprised they didn't. They had armies next to our settlements, which normally only means one thing. But it looks like they pulled out and decided it wasn't in their best interest after I summoned a whole bunch of mercenaries to back in my settlement. Uh, so we'll see how that goes as well. Gundabad attacks us, then we're going to have to strike and take take uh, Gundabad and Berzikul. I think both of those border Latash. We'd have to take two to extend that out. So that would be where we'd have to go in the north. Right home. Um, do we have any missions right now? Just refresh my memory. Mathelberg. Yeah, we're not taking Mathelberg. 
We're holding at Goblin Town because the other threat now is we actually border the dwarves. And the dwarves could uh, be fairly likely to declare war on us. Um, they've got a few armies around here, as the dwarves of Kazadu normally do. But uh, they, they could attack us as well because they border us here at Kazadoom. So that is a threat to also keep in mind. So we've got potential threats everywhere and big old threats, actual threats here as well. Um, so let's turn the turn. Where are you guys going? Stop. Stop. Ah, okay. Can you can you get away? Please be able to get away. Rally to me, men! We must regroup. Uh, he's, he's got away. Taking That's good. Camp here. They're hunting him. They're hunting him. He did not retreat in the direction I wanted him to retreat then. I would have wanted him to retreat towards the settlement, not away from it. Uh, yeah, if we take Alan and a rod in a single turn with catapult... Um, because I'm a little bit concerned. We can kind of see some of the troops in these goblin armies. A lot of warg pack. A few flame wranglers. Um, and I think the army with the faction leader has pretty much full uh, black pit units as well. No no low tier trash. So there's there's some scary armies here that the goblins are, are fielding. Look at them all. A lot of goblins. Ooh, wow. Uh, you have to fight through them. At least they're all in one spot. That's positive. Okay, can't do them. Yeah, we're getting some more units together. A bit more free upkeep there. That'll be good. That Graham as well. I think these units were just sending south constantly because... We're going to lose troops against these these goblins. Your That's will, for certain. Lord. Yes, my lord. By your command, we can go no further today. Listen up, as you wish. Tunneling south. March to exhaustion. Continue. A couple of lads here as well. Move them over. By your command, we'll yes. make camp here. At everyone. Train you. Okay. About to get military garrison up here. That'll make that a lot stronger, particularly if the, dwar the dwarves hit. We actually have some solid frontline units. A couple of turns on that catapult. I mean, all these I'm armies are within range to, I'm if we sieged here, for them, to, for them to hit us. So I'm not at all will, keen yes. on doing that. that let's just strengthen let's strengthen this army as much as we can an order can you just jump out because you have lower tier armor my lord listen as you wish you merge him and then you jump out and then we put the full one in right. um also we've got a full and fresh ones here my lord as you wish um Who's not full? Orders. Run merge. Get ready so for fighting. Out. Your Merging your will, my lord. My lord. An order. Your will, my lord. Your What's the elvish word for friend? Will, Spock mania. Thanks for the nine months. Mello. I'm curious if the backslash causes a pause in the TTS. Knock knock. Oh dear. Did you leave cool running on again? I don't think it had a pause. Maybe it was me really, really small, but it was it was marginal if it was. And thanks for the support. It didn't, yeah. I don't think it did. Uh you jump over to here. And that that then gives us three slots for these three to jump in. Alright, so this army is about as strong as it's gonna get. 
Um, is there another pike? Just worried about the number of archers I have here. One, two, three, four. No, I've got enough archers. That's good. Right, so then you fellas jump into here. Anyone merge? You are very low. Jump in. Okay. So yeah, this is the this is the trash leftover units. They just go behind again. We want to make sure the Witch King yes. is in the front. And just hold there until we get that catapult together. More turns. All that to say, thank you for this campaign. It's been really enjoying falling asleep to them. And this campaign especially with me being sick. Been great to just rest in bed with this one on the TV. Appreciate it, Spock Mania. And I'm glad I can, uh, I can help you through will, your uh, tough Orders. couple of tough days while you're sick. Your will, my lord. By your command. It's crazy thinking that I'm just beaming into your house, you know. Street TV. Will, uh, hello, Spock Mania. Your orders, my lord. Rockabye Spock yes. Mania. Yes, my lord. On the treetops. Uh, hey, did they siege? They didn't. Yeah, that's fine. I don't think we need to panic with more units here. I think we're good. Yeah, that's plenty and that other army kind of went upwards anyway so we're good there you you can make it in goodness for that get safely into yes. that hide hide amongst your men ultra should be going through the roof here yep there's a couple of spies around here still um yeah so let's just have a closer look at what's actually in these armies right but this army is fine one wool pack lots of Eric overseers yeah, see that army's fine. That's no problem. What about this one? This is got a flame wrangler, a couple of warg pack, but that's not too bad to deal with. Um, what about over here? Approaching quietly. I'm gonna this has got another you. flame wrangler. Cell, so cell swords. I don't think goblins could get cell swords. This I'm army is the blade. scarier one. We got three warg pack, four warg pack, flame wrangler. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, eight black pit units, a couple of mountain erics led by the faction leader. Yeah, this this army is is pretty troubling. Um, so there are they, they have some forces, right? They definitely have some forces here that we have to to deal with. We'll wait for the catapult. I think that's what we will decide on doing. Where's my diplomats? Am I still moving them? Over here. Yes, my lord. Right, so yes. we'll wait around here to get. Tomorrow's journey we'll planned. Keep moving to the next one. I Can shall continue goes for a fair tomorrow. Way. And my other diplomat is still just my lord, cruising around my lord. here. As you wish. See what's going yes, on. Yes, my lord. My lord. Okay. So, I mean, in's not bad, just direct income. Grab that. That's where we went. Bash leg. Markets. Kemeth Blin. Festunen. Trade. Make it happen, lads. Make it so. That army didn't attack the Crow's Nest either. They went somewhere else. Don't know, but town's going to be ready this turn. So this, no more defending on the on the map. On the Emin Sewell map. We're going to have just a standard walled settlement. Time to upgrade it. What do we get to? 2,500 population? Yeah, so... About 1,300 extra than what we would have if we'd immediately upgraded it. <sighs> Just very concerned about this. I don't think there's much else I'm going to be doing this turn, really. We've moved troops. we move moved the generals across. Still recruiting more up in the north here. We've got these Barrow Whites coming in. Uh, another three turns on general. Um, like, 
Am I confident in taking this fight? An order. If I siege this, right, and they came and brought like one, two, three, four armies. I don't know. I'm gonna stick it's you. a lot of flame wranglers to deal with. Particularly with the Witch King. I don't want yes. him getting just one shot by a wrangler. Not a very controlled environment. We will just wait. Wait for that catapult. <laughs> Okay, Bree has decided to siege up with all their dwarves, cell swords, and highly armored we merchant must make lads. Stand. We are besieged. They're coming for it as well. Okay. Why we got defenses along this front? Because we knew they'd be coming again. We stand vigil as the enemy surrounds us. Yeah, you guys want to siege up there as well? No? You're going to wait for wait for a general to lead you. Excellent. I'll be able to kill him. More generals the merrier. Send them in. And every turn we say don't do it Kundabat. Of some movement going on here. <laughs> Guys, want to get through your turns? Edible besieged. I'm gonna stick you. Nothing. Hmm. Are we ready this turn? Hey, where we do need to immediately get things building is over here. Because now, look at this. I got it upgraded and they've immediately come for me. Um, <laughs> so, yeah. Um, what do we need for the next upgrade? 5,000. So this is not a good defensive settlement now. Went from the pretty much one of the best in the game to now one of the worst. Of course, they decide that now is their moment to strike. Uh, we could get the military garrison at seven turns. We'll go for the Master Mason Soul. I think we're okay here. We can replenish troops. As long as we just don't flat out lose the battle, we can replenish troops. Ooh. It will be now, an honor we did you. have... Uh, I can't remember who, but someone in our last live stream said that the only time they've seen Deadman's Dyke or Fornos not be glitchy in version 5 with these soldiers walking to and fro out the front is when there's a secondary army and that kind of makes them come in so if there is that secondary army even even third army we'll have to see whether that whether they come in and whether that forces these guys to come in um so that'll be that'll be interesting to see and, you know i'm just going to not queue anything up right now we're a little bit um a bit short of cash Keep moving down. Your will, my lord. As you wish, my lord. By your command, we could go no further today. Or as you wish. Now the movement from Gundabad up here. Continuing later. Oh, we're good. What I probably do need is let's get this better armor. Is it for everyone? Okay. That. And let's try and get that militia garrison going. Catapult, are you ready yet? Next turn. Start moving you over. Uh, can we get a 18 generals, 19 regents? We might be able to get a man of the hour here. You can come across. Jump into there. Some resistance. Orders. Moving By down. Command, we can go no further Where are those today? two generals at? Over here? Yes, my lord. With honor. Your orders, my lord. Okay, go together. Yes, my lord. 
Moving. Making camp here. Good stuff. Oh, it's just nothing, right? Where's my wargs? An order. There's no Goddess. no range get units you. there. Get ready for fighting. We should get rid of it. I'll just let As it sit there. Marching to war. Give them no quarter this day, men. Take up arms and take victory. Let's give me some big battles against goblins today. I'm kind of a little bit, oh, you know, I'd like to have a couple of warm ups before I get into a big old, big old slingy match. Okay, what I'm gonna do is just send forward the um, javelins first and aim for these Zurich overseers. They're a little bit heavily armored. You guys just hold fire. And then once they're done, we can just get them out of the way and use the cab archers. Back here. And start to Give it to them. Another volley. Yep, that was pretty good. Another one. back. Why is it that cav archers move immediately when they're firing at will? I guess because they can keep firing even whilst moving, whereas archers when they're at fire at will and you tell them to move, they um they can't keep firing, so they have to complete their shot or whatever, complete their current order before they start moving in. That's pretty good. Let's move back. They're all done. All right, out we go. Over here. Let's move. Is this the general? I don't think so. I think this is actually the general here. Yeah. Do things up a bit. Yeah. Switch targets. Go fire at the right ones now. Good. Get them shooting at those. Okay. Only half the enemy force remains. Take them out. Pretty uh, stout goblin band. The enemy army flees the field. I started drummer with them. Run them down. Goblin band. <laughs> this is a clear victory. How many kills did those uh, skirmishes get? Twenty-two and twenty-four against the against the low armor, sorry, high armor, low mo model units. It's pretty good. Would have been quite a few missed. Javelin shots there. So the archers had a lot more trouble just killing the like seven Uruk overseas that were left. Had, like multiple volleys and only killed a few. The javelin's definitely good use against those. Uh, do we get a man of the hour perhaps? No. The day is ours. Also, so I want to check. Are there any? Hidden lads around here that are uh, giving me a draw out. No, they're not. Approaching. Okay. Just check. Back to that. Now they have moved some of these lads down. There would only be really the two armies here. Are these out of range? These ones? Yeah, they would be out of range. So maybe we actually do go for the siege up. An order. Come to that, siege. Finish them! Besieging the your will, my lord. As you wish. Go to there. By your command. 
to war then. Beginning the siege. The siege goes yes. And we'll see we'll see if they send any of these over to break that. I kinda wish they do I hope they do now. It's just a single army or something. I was just concerned if they sent all those four armies they had together. That would have been a bit scary. Not that we couldn't have won it, but we may have lost the Witch King to just a random Flame Wrangler um, shot, which would have been really, really disappointing, my lord. to say the least. Your orders, my lord. Yeah, we'll not, not queue things up at the moment. Okay, but down to 6k gold because we're being sieged as well. Okay, let's go. Send a Mattis. Here we go. Number one. We must make a stand. Now, we'll, I guess we'll get to see what sort of settlement we have here. Um, I think it'll just be the Palisade one that's kind of got the high ground, the high ground capture point, but no towers. That's, I think, what we're working with. Okay, so they brought that army back in response to me sieging it, but are they bringing... Okay, they bring over... Are they going to try and break the siege? They're bringing two armies. Are they going to attack anything? No. Okay, so that puts us in an interesting position. Hmm, a very interesting position, actually. We do make the attack. There's going to be a lot of troops coming in from weird angles. Gondor has been weakened. Good job, Mordor. Oh. The Dark Lord returns. Sauron, turn 110. He's back. Now, I don't know how he's going to like all these goblin... Goblin... Angmar interactions. The devotion and loyalty of the Dark Lord is unshaken and the lords from all evil realms bow before their master. Sauron's influence is getting stronger and invasions can now be launched if it pleases the will of the Dark Lord. Um, yes. Okay. So we have that yes, now as an option. Lord. Yes. Without questioning you along. Stopping here. Advisor promoted. Whatever. So. He doesn't like Isengard as much. But... We're all at max. That's not going to stay like that for long. Who's he going to favour? Me or the goblins in our war? That's that's the question. Morning, little Scotcho. You arrived just in time. Yeah, there's, there's things happening. Goblins potentially just made a mistake here. Um, look. Your will, my just, lord. Don't think we need more troops here. Orders. I think we've got enough. I mean, you could make Your it into will, this army, lord. but that would lose a lot of their movement range. I don't want to risk my that. Lord. I'd like to have movement if I need it. Your Let's will, go to lord. there. Orders, my lord. Jump in as, as you well. Wish. Everyone Orders. keep filtering down. Yes. March to exile, my lord. As you wish. Orders. Yes. March to exhaustion. Continuing later. Okay. Keep yes, going over. Lord. Yes. That general all available this turn. No, three turns time. Arrow whites are ready. Uh, didn't attack here. I'd like to kill them all in one foul Let's swoop if possible. On the field of Be gone. Let them all come together. Come and get None of them attacked. Coward. They're still sieging. Ooh, now there's a full stack I up here. You, my enemy. Let us settle matters on the. F it will be an honor defeating It's a faction, you. yeah. Okay. Wowzers! Time to start bribing the poach, Pope. Yeah. <laughs> You're watching your Arable campaign. My goodness, there are some stout, hardy dwarf fellows in those armies. What else do the Northern do not have? Do, do not have left a lot. They still have all the way up to here, uh, all through here, this area, and then they have. Um, south, they have Tharbad, across to Matrith, down to this settlement. I think we'll lay down to here. And I think l across here potentially as well. I think this settlement too. 
Um, so they, there's, they got a lot. Still a lot of land they have. So non-passive this campaign. Oh yeah, they've been very non-passive. Oh, that's good. Our friends, our allies, the Dunlendings, they've broken a peace with Northern Dunedain. Means they won't fall to the expansionist horror that is the Northern Dunedain. Okay, so we got... We're retraining the lads up here. Yeah, just give them better armor, anything we can, just in case have an attack. Uh, I don't really need the catapult now. I'll just leave him there at Zag Carla because it'd be pretty good defensive for right now if they attack there. Um, hopefully that doesn't occur though because we're going to take down that rod. We didn't get building. I guess just leave construction still again. Don't, put, don't queue anything up because we're short of money. Cool. Good to see you being challenged. Yeah, we got... We got a few enemies They're everywhere. So, an order. Your will, my lord. This army is pretty much trash. I'm gonna stick you. Saying that most of this army's trash as well. Um. This army would come day. in from our left blank yes hmm now we have night attacker on on this guy i think but i imagine this guy will have night attacker as well so that won't make much of a difference I might exclude this day. one though so that might be enough to go for that i think might just be enough to go for it And also, if anyone's saying you don't use artillery, you should point them to the Erebor campaign. There's a lot of catapults being used. I mean, I'll use it when when it's when it's appropriate. I got a catapult here. I was going to use him to attack Alan and Rod in one turn, but then they kind of gave us an opportunity, moved away some of their armies. I think we just got to go in. I'm looking. There's nothing really else for us to do. We we just got to go in here and and hope for the best. Uh, so you make the assault. If we, because we can just attack, right, and take an open field battle. Could do that as well, but I think maybe we can get a better advantage by attacking the settlement. I think we can catch him, catch him coming in as reinforcements. We if we go there. Have you got have you got siege equipment as well? Marching you have. Good. Um, Moving to crush the enemy. We go to there. All right. So let's just see what our options are here. The control by AI. Yep. You're gonna come in. We need you to overthrow them with numbers. And this is the inside the settlement. No additional defenders. Uh, we got. This lad over here. And then we got... This is the good army, right? It's the faction leader army. It's It's got some really good stuff in there. Um, but they would be... Immediate left. Where would that translate to on the battle map? That's the question. Immediate left. It's not in a corner. That should be halfway along. It should be halfway along our left hand flank. Your army looks like a last stand army. Nicely balanced, top tier units. <laughs> yeah, a little bit like that, isn't it? Um, see, if I go knight attack, that gets rid of him, but it also gets rid of him. I don't think I want to do that. I mean, balance of power does indicate that that is slightly better for us. We get rid of them all in one go. Let's have a big old battle, shall we? Let's do it. So, left. Immediate left. 
Halfway along immediate left. There'll be no escaping us now! Attack! <sighs> oh. Pinning the second army against the red line could be great with the faction leader. They should fight to the death. I'm hoping so. It's just we got to predict where they come in. I'm just... I haven't had as much experience with reinforcements because normally you just go for a draw out right um you'd normally just go for the draw out you wouldn't go for attack the settlement with reinforcements coming in so if we're here they were coming in from our immediate left now where's the, where's my reinforcements Where are my reinforcements? They were sieging as well. They should be they should be waiting here. Are they gonna appear once we hit start battle? Um I don't know where they're at. They should they should be here. They they were on our right flank. They should be over here, set up. Question is, their army, is it coming in from here or is it coming in from here? I don't know which one. Because it wasn't in a corner. You'd guess halfway between the two? <sighs> this is what I mean. I'm just. I feel like I've been in this situation before and they come in from here. There's something in the back of my head is telling me they're going to come in from from halfway down here. So we've got quite a few infantry. So what we're going to do is we don't need to worry about the, the settlement attack. And by the way, we've got the other ones going in for that anyway. So we're going to leave. We're going to come from this side. Um... Barely any. Mm. But if they get all those other reinforcements inside the settlement, that could be bad. Um, maybe we should do a simultaneous attack. What if? Mm. What if I just got inside the settlement? What if I got inside the settlement and defended, like at the capture point, from the reinforcements? Hmm, I'd have to be quick. I'd have to be quick. There's only three set there's only three units guarding the settlement right now. These three units. The one at each gate, the ladders. Let's have the wargs over here to delay them a bit. Alright, try and slow them up. Over here somewhere. Because we have to be away from the towers, that's the thing. We have to be in, in here to defend the center point. And then we can then we can take a fight. Um Right. Let, let's do that. Let's go for that. That plan seems a little more aggressive. Cause my concern is if we take this big fight out, out here with the faction leader's army, our secondary army might, might might get beaten from by their secondary army, and then their secondary army gets inside, and then we have to assault a settlement that's full of troops. Um, and that is a little more scary. I think I'd rather just get inside off the bat. So, what we'll do is... Um, Pikes? Where's the third one? Pikes should be able to push through a little bit. If there's something in the gateway. Oh, you gotta be off armor. Alright, so. When you go there, when you get over here, there's three gates. Okay. Get over here. Just try and get in. 
We gotta break through. We gotta be really aggressive here. Break through, kill whatever's there, and then get get in. Um, and then... Where are you lads? Just drop your ones there. And let me get my archers. Up on the... These ones. Don't think there'll be anything defending the walls. These are just simply to get through to the center to draw them back if they're not, if we haven't had success. So, I'm looking for alternate paths. There doesn't appear to be any. There doesn't appear to be it. There's one. Okay. So, send one to here. Hmm. Not many good ways in, is there? And there's ones over here. to go this way and then let's just have one two one two three over here and we, and we just got to get through out of formation one two three um here out of formation and then who's left? One, two. Over here. <clears throat> no, other side. Over here. Through there. The glory of um. You, I don't want anywhere near towers, but I do gotta get you inside because they have wall pack. Um, I mean, I guess I put you with the cab. No, I'll, I'll leave you here. I'll leave you here. This is fine over here. March. Welcome in the Tin Man. Great to see you. Let's go for it. Go, go. They came in. I said control by AI. What What are they doing? I had them on control by AI. They're not marching in. No, maybe they are. No, they're not marching. Oh well. Uh, <laughs> okay. Um, well. The glory of you guys gotta get over there. Run, run, run. Get in, get in, get in, get in. Everyone in here. Let's go. Quite sure they were AI Our controlled too. The Witch King needs no reinforcements. Battle. Yeah, apparently not. Um, guys, you on fire at will? Uh, okay, so some flame wranglers there. Pull back a bit. Well, don't let the flame wranglers get shot on you. As we gotta get in. What are you doing? Go through the front gate. Drop that. Go through the front gate. We just gotta get inside. We got we got people coming in from all flanks. We gotta just get in. The battering ram is in place. It'll not be long before our enemies' defenses for men have reached the walls with their ladders. We can take the fight if we're in here. We just gotta get in. I don't know if we're I mean, just pull back a little bit. Hold fire, hold fire. Archers hold fire. The ladders are now in place. Walls are no match for the valor and force of our is, is this okay, which can get up here? They've moved back from the tower, so it's okay. Okay. 
heck? Wargrazer charged in on us. The battering ram is in place. Guys. Not be long before our enemy's defenses fall. Battering ram has done its work. Guys. Get in there. Okay. Fellas, get get in. Everyone in. Everyone in. Everyone in. Everyone in. Get away from everyone get to here, okay? Everyone get to there, go. You fellas get in. Get in. Get in, get in, get in, get in, get in, get in, get in. Get in. Get in. Everyone in, everyone in, everyone in. What about over here? What's going on? Oh, we took out a wolf pack unit. Nicely. Okay, pull back. Don't, 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 don't. Don't fight it, don't fight it, don't fight it. Pull back, pull back. Fellas, you gotta get in there. Get in. Which can get over here. Guys, hurry up. They're getting closer. They're getting closer. Get in. Get in, fellas. Our men are in command of the castle. Okay, guys, guys, get in there, get in there. Our men no longer command the castle. Get in there, get in there, get in there. Everyone in. Everyone in. Everyone in. Like your life's depend on it because they truly, truly do. That wolf pack is still chasing me. Run away, run away. We fight for the Iron Crown. You guys just get everyone in it. Everyone in. Just snag a stool with them. Just kill him. Just get in here. Get in here. Get in here. Get in here. Where's the general? Okay, over here. Over here. Charge on the back of this. Okay. In that, go. Everyone in. Okay, we killed the rest of those wolf pack. Good. Okay, what do we got coming over? Black infantry. We gotta get this uh, flame wrangler as well. Pull back. Everyone in. Everyone in. Fellas, you gotta get it. You gotta stop fighting around here and get in. Get in. Get in. Get in. Get in. Get in. Set up here. Set up here. Ignore all that and get in there. Come down, guys. You gotta move. Get away. Get away. Get away. Get away. Get away. Just snag a stalker. Just run past them. Just run past them. They're not worth it. Okay, good. That's the first general. They're routing. They're fucking. Okay, good. Go over here. Okay. Nice. Nothing coming from that direction. How are we going, guys? Get in here. Get in here. Okay. Double layer. Get here. Go, go, go. Fellas, fall back. Run, 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 run. run. Attacking you. Wolf pack. Here we go. Get rid of that wolf pack. That needs to die. Just run away. There's more wolf pack coming. Oh my goodness. Wolves are going to get roasted here. We go. We got to run them. Um, everyone. Okay. Go get everyone set up inside so we can micro the archers. Lost control of the castle. Get to here. Our men have taken control of the castle. Up here, up here, go, go, go. Up here. And then you come over here just in case something comes from that direction. Okay. Where are the wolves at? Where are the wolves at? Where are the wolves at? Okay, they kind of backed off. Good. Come over here. There's something over here that's stuck. What is it? Get in there, get in there, go, go. Bikes down. Yeah, they're just fighting there, it's whatever. Cool. It's hard to pull them back now. Get through, get through, get through, get through. Run, 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 run. 
What's getting close to you? Walk back. Okay. You two, I want you to go around and take out this, um, this flame wrangler. Yeah? So one of you come to there. One of you go to there. The enemy are badly bloodied. The other ones. They have lost half their men. You keep shooting the shooting the wolf pack that's coming. Lord and iron. The hills will be ours. It's down. Over there, dead. They're doing their darndest to give me some time. It's okay. Now, there could be more wolf pack coming from this flank. They just go to there. Archers. Where did I get all my uh, all my archers out of combat? Get to here. I know where you are. I've got nothing coming from that direction. Our men are in command of the castle. Over there. Our men no longer command the castle. Yeah, we'll go over there. Okay. Still running. Still chasing us. Go go go. And walk pack, shoot the bastards, kill them all. You'd think a warg could kill a warg, right? But no, this is not the case. Coming back, where are you at? And you go directly for this guy here. You, I want to run around this way. This. Okay, about Goblin Band. His reinforcements are definitely not coming in. Shooting him. We're going to run out of ammunition soon. That's not good. We have to get inside once that happens. Okay, uh, could you just block that way just in case something does come over there? Okay, get in, get in, get in. We need more, need more, need more. They yeah, are just pushing in. Let's go. In from the flank. Get in there. And maybe there's an opportunity there to shoot with archers, but I kind of missed it. Let's turn around this way, actually. Yeah, they're further away still. Where are those wolves back at? They're still coming. Keep shooting them. Run across, run across. Hey guys. You gotta get in amongst this flame wrangler because the wolf pack's gonna be here in a moment and you're not gonna have them dead. Get around here. Would charging the wolf pack be disastrous? Oh yeah. You guys get over here. Uh, Wolfpack have a special attack. Um, they are skilled against mounts and they have a special attack. It is nigh on impossible for a cav unit to hit them. Um, and if they get into combat, they just mulch through cav like, like wood in a chipper, man. Like wood in a chipper. They do not, they do not care. Um... Okay. Archers. Yeah, I reckon now we can start opening up on that. Start giving it to him. Also, can you run down to here? Capture this gate. We got more infantry elsewhere. So I'm lobbing that in. Oh, yeah, that should deal with that side pretty well. Um, you need to get over here. Need more units. Pikes have kind of like fallen back, but are still holding. Get this center point. Need more support there. Okay, I'm opening this gate, hopefully. Guys, get in here. Yep, it's open. Okay, just get in, get in, get in, get in. 
Oh no, you're 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 doing. Hang on, hold on. You're going over here. So everyone wants to get over there. Alright. I mean, we'll fight these guys. Let's see how we go. This 34, 30. We'll see. Um. You lads, get inside. If we don't need to get inside just yet, we can wait here. Wait here. And get that gate open, you get it back over here. Okay, how are we going? Archers are firing into this flank. Yep, right into there. Excellent. Keep keep sending it. Okay, so let's see. So yeah, we've lost 20, like, what, 25 at the moment for the killing. Now, they're actually, each two numbers represents one warg. Um, so we've killed, like, three, four wargs. Yeah, it's just not, it's not a good ratio. Uh, can you guys just fight? Same here. Let's fight. What is this? Is their captain? Uh... Look, guys, just get inside. I don't, I don't want to lose you. I reckon... Come here, you guys can still shoot. Get a, just get a halberd down here and we can kill their captain, maybe. This is a lot of Blackbeard Halberds in here. Doing a lot of work. Keep shooting in it. Keep the kills coming. Old fellas. Old. Oh shit. Over here. Over here. What are they? Blackbeard infantry, Blackbeard infantry. That's not too bad, we can deal with that. Okay, where are those, where are those halberds? Get over here, inside, inside. Archers, keep, keep shooting in it, keep firing. Shots coming. We've kind of got a surround on these ones now. We should be fighting them pretty decently. Come on, come on, come on. There's a unit here, there's a unit here. You want to fight? Come on, these guys. These guys. That's my wall over here. Sergeant. Yeah, that, these guys are still alive. Oh, okay. Oh, we got a unit come in. Reinforcements. Okay, get over here. We can hit something in the rear, maybe. They're not gonna route because they're um. We can't get in through there because the oh no, no, we destroyed the gates. We can't get in. Go to there. I right, can we can charge us in the back and route everything. Get over here. Here. They're kind of just pushing through the lads. Archers, aim further back. Back here, back here. We fight for the Iron Crown. Get in there, kill them. Oh man, this is. What's well, actually the stats on these guys? What are we? 14 and 16? I mean, 7 and 14. We are. We do outmatch the them pretty badly, significantly. Bloody. They have lost half their men. They just sent it in here. Where's that halberd unit? No, the halberd unit's outside. Okay, kill, kill, kill. Come on, you can do it, you can do it. Take him out, take him out, take him out, take him out. 
a mulching tree, but I believe. Yep, you're killing him at least. Good, got, got a lot of them, got a lot of them. Fairly good trades. Sound like that. Opposition. Where's that other one that just came in over here? Can you get into the back of this and just charge into this. There you go. Get in, and we'll combine that with a with a um, shout from the Witch King. I'm starting to push through, aren't they? Yeah, archers are pretty much out of ammunition. Only half the enemy force remains. Get here. Okay, and then into that. I can give him the route. Come on, him in the back. Give him the route. That's not going to route any of that. Uh, okay, you can drop that and start moving. Okay, deal with the flame wrangler. Done. Get over here. Hit them in the back. There. Yeah, we've, we've routed them. I think we've mainly routed them here. Good. Kill them, kill them, kill them, kill them. Go, 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 go. Okay, um, hold fire. Hold fire, hold fire. Archers, you're now pretty much out of ammunition. So. Turn around and face this way. You're now infantrymen. Is that you just came in over here? Into there. They're routing pretty much. Good. Kill them all. Kill them all. Kill them all. Kill them all. What the hell? Oh my goodness. Okay. Um, fight them then. Might route. We might actually just give him to route here. Yep. Good. Okay. Good. Kill him. Kill him. Yeah. Okay. We got him to route. It's, it's good there. Saved a lot of troops. They're trying to get to the center, so we're cutting them down as they go to the center. Very good. Uh, can we go recapture that gate. But that gate was ours. Yeah. 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 Sorry. 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 Go this way. Go this way. What have we got here? Mountain Eriks. Yeah, we can, if we can get a fight with them here and we can hit them with some rear charges. Okay, the wolves can now come out again. Get out of there. The white wolves look cool. Yeah. Get over there. Around the back of those ones and re recharge them. What's going on here? How come they've put around our back? How the hell did that happen? Yeah, I don't know how it happened, but... Get in there. Our ally lies dead. Without that general, they may lose heart and flee. In here? Are you king? Okay. Blood and iron! Where's the witch king? He's back here, that's fine, okay. Fight them, turn around, turn around, turn around, turn around. Okay, what do you got out here? Something. Good infantry, sure. Okay. Going, what do we got outside the gate over here? Right, we got lads engaging, we need their recharge. Okay. And their secondary recharge ready, the and their third recharge the ready. Pursue and run them down. Let's go. Take them out. For the moment, the fortune Very of good. battle goes our flat, way. Flat, flat, flat. Let's pray it remains as such. The enemy general. Very nice. Dead. I think that's the faction leader. Oh my goodness, that fight in the middle has been an absolute bull. Okay, yeah, we got him, we got him, we got him, we got him. Everyone chase him. Okay. That side looking good. This side is. They're wavering. Get in there, get in there, get in there. Get 
guess they're in the capture square, so they're not going to route. So there's no use trying to send the rooms and route them. Just get this complete surround. Okay, and then get in there. out okay what do we got outside the gates no inside the gates they come up our ladders that's pretty funny um okay Where are they at? Go stand, just go stand over and we should kill them. Then, okay, so what we need to do now is blockade center points. Build everything over here. them. Got him. There's still one more here. Come to that. Got him. Okay, good, 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 good. Go back to hit. Kill him! Come in. What are you doing? Over there. Gotta get the capture point here, because i start getting it ticking down. It's a long capture. A mentoring command of the castle. Okay, so now what we need to do is make sure we keep command of the castle. So go to there. Direction they're coming from over here. Yep. Okay, so we need to go meet them out there. We await your command. Keep your boots under control. Here, make sure you don't get through. Go through on that side. Okay, just leave a guy here just to make sure nothing gets into the capture point. Okay, like that. A bit more like over here. Okay, there. What's this? Our long bowman coming in. Good, nothing that way. Okay. Now, when they route, we can't let anything get through. That's why we got some other lads here. To me, Hillman. The battle is very much in our favor. Victory will be ours. Under here. Stay in there. Make sure we got something capturing it. Don't move everything out. Okay. The hills will be ours. Okay. If they recapture it here, we're probably in trouble. Uh, because the time is going to run out on us. Get them. Yep, they're done. Okay. Couple of lads over here. See if you can come and kill them. 
Just in case the timer does get reset, we gotta make sure we get everything else. Just a matter of cleaning up bits and pieces. No, they're barrels, not, not goblins. Okay. Okay. Wowzers. That flank looks like they could run down that side. Get something over there. The enemy army flees the field. Pursue and run them down. Oh. Our foe is utterly vanquished. Let all who remember this day remember it as the day of our most glorious victory. Now, something I have forgotten to do is to get healing traits on the Witch King. All 574. Yep. Pretty sure the general died. I'm pretty sure the general died. Pretty sure. 6,000 units killed. Who had the most kills? Iron Crown Longbowman, 519. Iron Crown Warriors, 595. 701 Iron Crown Halberdiers. 701. Wow. Zero healed. Yeah, I need to get some healing traits. We could have healed a lot of those troops. We didn't then. Woo! The battle for Anon Anarod. I think we ended up doing the right thing, getting inside the settlement. I'm pretty sure they came in from halfway down the map. Should have probably looked at that, but I was busy concentrating on other things. Warrior's leader is dead. is the fate of all who oppose us. That is right. Victory! These people now kneel before us, my lord. Orcs! Your will, my lord. Get ready for fighting, my lord. Bells can move up. By your command, we can go no further today. Orders, my lord. Okay. No herbalist here, which is why I want to get... Do I have any generals nearby with, um... With the herbalist doctor traits? He's got herbalist, not doctor. Um... He just needs to sit in a town with a herbalist for a bit. Um... I mean, I think he's going to be here for a while because, yeah, public order is only 130% with him being in here. So, I think he's going to be here for a while. So, let's get the herbalist straight away. Uh, none of them can retrain. We've got 97%, so that'll help public order. Um, and we can retrain most of these units straight away, it looks like. Well, when we have the replenishment. Herbalist going, that stuff. I'm gonna my lord. And I'd like to get in some more of the Iron Crown Order, units. Get them in and then merge. As you wish, my lord. Alright. Now what else do we want in there? Your will, Anything that's decent, yep. Order. Those, the wolves. We are savages. There you go. Is there any... No, there's no garrison structure here. And then maybe... Archers. Did they take a bit of a beating? A little bit, but not too much. Uh, maybe just a... Angmar and infantry and an Angmar and archer. Your will, my lord. Jump in. Yes. Orders. Okay. The rest of you.
pull back for now. What has Brunos got? What's your garrison? Okay, they're all coming down. Hopefully we can get enough of an army together. We probably need to wait for these these two generals. Where are they at? They're not too far away now. Then they can lead an army to go down to Austin the Thiel. And then that will cut off Brunos being a border as well. At the moment they could march from here across us and go straight to Brunos. That would be exposed. Uh, if I didn't want to have to sally out. But and we got rid of the big army. I think I'd be pretty happy going out with the bid with the Witch King to cut off anything on its way across. Uh, but we just have to make sure we still defended Alan and Arod. My lord. Alright, that worked out really well. 1,000 gold again next turn. So Anon Anorod is a good um, good economic castle. It's got nice mines. Alright. The end turn is upon us, I believe. Probably going to have some defensive sieges. Two, probably. Three, probably. Give me a long end turn. Alright. Strap in. So we got Dwarven, Dwarven Merc Bree, Dwarven Bree, along with Edithelion, who's got eh, some good, some okay Dinodyne units, but a lot of Cav, um, some Siege Equipment, some Breland units, some bit of medium tier army. Um, now, we're going to see whether with the secondary army, they come in through the gates. This is what we're going to test out. Uh, because this was a speculation yesterday. So we'll see today if that's how it works. Muster your courage, men. We march into battle. You ready? You're strapped in, little Scotcho. <laughs> it's going to be a long end turn if all these sieges pop. Oh. How about that? How about that battle, though, little Scotcho? How about that one? The tide of battle that seems goblins, to have turned against us. That goblin fight. We must act and halt this turn Ooh. of events. That was good. And the cherry on top is that we get the uh, the faction leader. Can you rebuild Deadman's Dyke? I don't believe so. Three, I am 99.9% .9 sure that I cannot. The archers are starting to get... Oh, these archers are getting low. But the other ones are actually replenished because we, we got the barracks up and running. That's actually much better. So glitchy here. You can't like I go like that, and then this one can I get like like a little? Uh, you can't. Right, so like that. Forward. Like that. I don't know. Right. All fire. A few wargs. They are for reserve for running things down. Rates. They probably like position yourselves like behind them. But if there is like if they do come in, so it's once again if they do, they don't get shot as much by the um horse archers. Then we got a couple of Iron Crown lads. Uh got the faction leader, Gimara Infantry, a couple of a couple of them. So there's a different, some different variables here. So they might want to attack. And there, but on defensive. And there, but on defensive. And here, but on defensive. Okay. 
you gonna shoot anything? Shoot at these plebs. Don't you shoot at Okay, so we got a secondary army. I don't think you can knock down the walls, fellas. Pretty sure they're indestructible. Because there's all these buildings behind them, so you can't actually get in. Yeah. I mean, I would love them to come in. This is, <laughs> you know, the fact they glitch out all the time is not is not good for me. Uh, Longbeard phalanx, definitely shoot those. What's the order in here? The you, and then you, then him, and then you're last. So you, 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 you. in that order. Definitely shoot those dwarves. Alright, what do we got here? Watchman, sword guard, bandits, lumbermen. Yep, shoot lumbermen. Um, don't worry the about shooting shield guards. The uh, too much. Shoot some bandits. So shoot, shoot some sword guards. Go here now. Bell swords. How are we going? Working through these long beard phalanx. Blast their eyes. The enemy's ram is through our gates. Yeah, okay, now. Let's just see now. They're gonna start doing their shuffling antics. Cold fire. But with the secondary army coming, will they come in? And will the first army actually move? That's that's what we're gonna see here. Uh, Merchant Cav, we want to take out. Cav is not good on my Barrow Whites. Um, you shoot at the that's guard here. Cell swords. Watch the spear guard. Take them out. Good. You go for Watchman. Uh, spell swords are shifting again. Journeyman. Journeyman. I suppose. Cancel guard. Spell swords. Oh, fire. Can we spearmen? Journeyman. Gatekeepers. Shoot them in the back there. Secondary army is still making its way over. Out of ammunition, so could you fellas get off the wall? Not sure we get rid of. I can't hard to tell because there's the other army as well, but 21% of the total forces. Pretty good. Clouds moving look cool. Yeah. It's the backdrop of the ruined city, the silhouette against the trees. Actually, that is pretty cool. Hill behind with the silhouette, the clouds. Uh, 
At you come, fellas. Keep moving. Okay, so. Secondary army is starting to arrive. Are they going to shuffle and do the same thing? Or are they going to come in? And if they do come in, will that trigger the other ones to come in? Really kind of, yep. Yeah, you're out of the way. Are they coming in? They're moving forward. They kind of look like they're coming. They're shooting. That shows that they're still active. Yeah, they're coming. Okay, so a secondary army will come in. But will... Will the primary army then take their lead and go in after them? Doesn't look like it. Doesn't look like it. Okay. Well, that's interesting to say the least. I mean, if anything, if I was a... Yeah, if I was a... The modder, then, you know... I'd be very... Okay, we gotta shoot these rangers. Shoot these scouts. Kill these scouts. Go over here, go over here. I, I would be very interested in that information because that to me would be like prime prime information for how to fix this damn bug yeah, well, you guys are getting roasted we're all getting roasted Get over there oh man my raids so many lives lost I should have had them off to the side So we gotta deal with this this uh, Dudine army that we haven't weakened at all. You guys get forward, go, go, go. shot to pieces. Pull back more and shot. Something changes in the course of battle, for defeat seems almost certain. Pull to the sides. Um Last time I saw this reported as a bug in the Discord, it was um, re just replied to by one of the moderators that it wasn't a concern, that it did, that this, that it wasn't, that it always behaved like it, it always did. But there was no change between this and the previous version, um, which is just bollocks. Oh shit, they are really pushing through. Um, there has definitely been a shift. Because they would do this every battle. They would always come in. Like, this army would have done this in, in previous version. Uh, they are really pushing in here. Let me get some lads. guys good trying to make it all the way to the capture point. I mean, I've got some archers back here They're blocking the path they're doing the old goblin strat just just push through with your numbers in fighting A lot of cab here should go down reasonably easily as long as they stop shooting me. When you shoot these guys, shoot shoot the shoot the general. That's fine. Shoot him. Uh, wolves, don't fight wolves. Trying to get across here and get another layer. Back here. Anything coming through. Uh, how are we going? 
Oh, there's a Doondine bodyguard in there, shoot. That's not on. Goodness. Just a mosh pit. Yeah, now imagine if everyone just came in instead of just staying there. I would have been in serious trouble. Um, I mean, I'm holding back my whites to, to clean up everything out here. Um, the unit's making it through still. Guys, please. Alright, I think we're I think we're kinda of getting under control. Eventually. Can you get in here? Clean up some of this garbage. Get on him. Stop him from firing. Gee. Spread out so they don't get shots. Feet seems almost certain. Get out of here. Get out. Imagine if they got, they ran through right now and killed my faction leader. That would be something else. Just bait me the entire time just to kill. Actually, they're firing. Hold up. Hold up. Hold up. They're firing. They have not done that. That means they're actually somewhat activated again. Uh, I might not send my faction leader in there just now. Get over here. Because they had not been doing that previously. Now they're firing through. Attacking us! Okay, general down. Right, so that's that army dealt with, I think. One army. Right, so, question is... Is this secondary army going to come in now? Or the, the primary army, actually? I don't think so. Mainly Archer. There is a bloody Legion Spear Shield Guard here. Not a lot of Cav. Alright, how's shooting though, which is a bit of a concern. I don't like that. Because that means if I s send my Barrow Whites here, we've got to get them stuck in the melee. Righto. Barrow Whites. Um, you two can go first. So just try and get this get them stuck down in combat get them fighting okay You're still back here. Get in here. Alright, fellas, cut them down. They're Legion, Shield Guard, they don't have a lot of attack, they're just tanky because they're armor. Get around on this 
flanked a little bit. That's fine. Let's kill him. Okay. down. Lumber mother, 88. Okay. Legion shield guard are proving to be a bit of a problem. Everything else here should be fine. Those brave whites. Yeah, man. They feel no fear. Cutting down the, the Breland aggressors. Yes. The aggressors. Oh man, these guys are taking a bit of a battering out on this flank here. Now, can I get my... These guys out here? They, they're kind of getting a little bit surrounded. This side's okay because they're kind of just a, a nice front. This side is getting surrounded a bit. And 26, gee, they're really getting cut. They don't want to lose a unit. I think pulling them out of combat right now would probably be bad. I just need to try and get another unit in here to support. I don't really care about these guys much, so run them through. Run them through, run them through, run them through. And then kind of just get in amongst the stuff here. Let's offer some more bodies for him to kill. Okay, okay there we go. Those guys were getting surrounded out in the flank, that was a problem. Even if it was just surrounded by, like, you know, bandits. Now that they've pushed in, I reckon I could probably try and extract them. It'd be hard, they're kind of still fighting the front lines. Push through more. They have lost half their men. Fight. See if I can get them out. Oh, they're on defensive. Oh, that's why they're freak me. They're on defensive. Fight, 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 fight normal, fight normal. Okay, let's see if we can get them out. They don't need to fight anymore. We should get a lot of healing, but the healing will probably not be on these guys this time because they're the last ones to die this time. Oh man, I tell you what, this Legion Shield Guard really did make this a lot tougher. Finish them off. There's more units there. Holy mackerel, there's more? Well, we're out of time anyway. Um, okay. Well, we're going to win, so they're not going to get any replenishment or any healing. General? 
Minute 30 to kill the general. He's right there. Come on, you got him. It's really right. Oh, they firing. Oh, no, 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 They have dwarven catapults. The day has ended and spared our enemy even greater defeat. He didn't kill this there general, unfortunately. Such victories. Wow. Okay. Those dwarven extras in the Breland armies are making them very hard to kill. Um. Yeah. Most of our healings on our defenders, which we get back for free anyway. So. Might need to change the way that I do that because uh, we're going to want our, our healing to occur on our good units. I guess some of those Barry White's healed because they got shot at the start. Um, but yeah, none of the ones at the end. Gee. Um, it's a good thing I got those few additional troops there. I had more left. Traders Brelanders won't even fight themselves relying on mercenaries. Yeah. Um, yeah. Be that as it may, if the mercenaries are fighting for them, then we're going to have to deal with them. Gee, the dwarves. No, I have no. Okay, so we wiped out the Lord of the Army. They got sent packing. There's more on its way, and. Okay, next. Next. Okay, they got a ballista. One ballista. And captain is the dude on cap. A lot of Brelanders in here though. We attack! I didn't think there was any double walled settlements that existed in DAC. What? An actual double walled settlement? I mean, I know they're in Med 2, but. In vanilla Med 2. I've never seen a double walled settlement in DAC. Okay. Towers are circular as well. Interesting. I, I gotta just my brain is a little bit um foggy at the moment. I need to I need to think about how I'm gonna defend this then. They can make best use of what I'm having here. So these are towers, yeah? These work. They should do. They're all towers. Um so question is, is it better to defend back here? I mean we got this wall here, we could have the towers firing. This one here we could have firing down. Um is it even any better than just defending at the gate here? I mean, there's quite a few towers here. If we can stop them from firing with their ballista, which I'm thinking about doing. Then we could probably... 
Recommend to defend the interior walls and use the wargs to activate the outer towers until they get inside. Yeah. I mean, I think that's probably a fairly good call. Just sit everyone up here for now. Um, I was thinking of using these guys out here on the outer, the outer defenses just to keep the defenses going. They can hold for like a long time up. Like, set them up on the wall. They can just hold up here for a long time and keep all the towers going and they'll commit troops to them. Um, I know what I was thinking of going with. Those guys? Yeah, good thinking, yeah. Um, we'll just have them like out here and then have the wargs maybe activating some of these. I'll send the wargs out and, and kill them and then... Is they, are they even going to be able to get into the secondary wall? They have multiple rams. Yeah, they do have multiple rams. Because they're going to commit all of this stuff. Yeah, they have three rams. So they will... They have four rams. They will be able to get in. Um, yeah. It's odd. Odd, odd, odd. Um, so then over here, I'd want to have... I don't know if they're going to come over here. I mean, it's, not, it's been so long since I've actually just defended a double-tiered settlement. Um, so if they can shoot across there, but they can get up here and attack them. Just have a pike here. Defending that, but... I don't know. It's really dumb. Um, so I can have archers... Firing in from there. This is such a good spot here, though. Up here. Move out. As they as they make their way in. What if I had like Archer Archer and had like a Ruda Savage or something up here? Yeah, just protect him if anything does come over here. I mean he might just get shot, but I don't know. We'll experiment with a bit. Go like that there. To me, Hillman! Now I've got you. Up here. Oh, you've actually got. Um, hang on. Oh, hang on. <laughs> uh, so, go to like. Wider. Them there. I'll run him back. Um, and then pikes. Okay, we'll move you in a second. The hills will be ours. The hills will be ours. The hills will be ours. We got one and two me, in reserve. And you're over here. Then, then we pull you back. Is that then everyone? I think so. Um, like they're gonna come running through here. So maybe I guess you know it's not gonna have to have someone over here just activating these towers. In case they get to shoot at something. Um, and remember, I have stakes here. Not run my wolves through my own stakes. Okay, you get it back over to here. Now, these towers as well. Yeah. Man, vanilla, vanilla, medieval two settlements are so. This is the tower as well. Oh my goodness, vanilla total war settlements are freaking OP. I've forgotten how po OP these two tiered settlements are. Like this is just insane. How how do you how are you meant to do that? I mean, I thought they were all removed from the game. In all honesty, um, I honestly thought 
that they were removed from the game. All of the um, two-tiered settlements in, in DAC. I've never seen one in, in, in DAC ever. I don't know if it's like special to this settlement that this particular settlement gets it. And instead of charging in here, what I'm going to do is use my ammunition. I reckon I can kill him faster. Go. Okay. Everyone fire. Is he going to shoot at me? Shoot, 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 shoot. Take this out. The routing, get a couple more volleys. Don't want to get back on their equipment. those okay that's pretty good let's pull out now remember we have stakes when we get back inside um go you I want to go this way They continue to route, or they they come back. No, I think they I think they're gone. Yep, he's gone. Good. Units, move as soon as I saw the round towers, I thought something was different, and then I like looked around. I've gone, no way. And this is this is a fake. This just this section here is effectively one of those mini forts. Like the fort battles, like you've got all these towers. Every one of these these structures here are towers. Like these are all gonna fire. This is a tower as well. If you had troops over there, but I don't want probably troops over there. Um, kill, kill more of our own. Like this one's here a tower. I and mean, you just there's so much. I don't even know if I want this one firing. Maybe I do. I don't know. Brutal salt, yeah. Yeah, they're coming up here. That's okay. I'll fire. I'll fire. That's just firing as well. Our enemy's ladders have reached our walls. Time for butchers, Okay. Now, hang on. Nothing coming up here? That's burning. The wolves. Firing on that. Right the Repel the attackers. Give them steel. The enemy's siege tower is naught but kindling now. Beware, lest they try some other trick. They're going to go to the back of them. It should be okay to hold for a the enemy while. Are battering down our gates. Can we get to here and shoot up, perhaps? Oh, that didn't even... That burnt? There's nothing... I mean, we just keep the towers firing for now. Shoot up here. The enemy's ram has breached the gates! And some shots on. The enemy have the walls! To our defense or all will be lost. Come back. Stakes are doing their job. They 
Coming up on the wall, excellent. Pray something changes in the course of battle. The defeat seems almost certain. Got going on them as they come around. Yep, just run them around the edge. They just commit to that fight there. Make them run. Happening over here. Bunch of horses died. Excellent. Oh, guys, guys, guys. guys. Did you get back inside? I didn't even check. That would have been bad if you hadn't. Are these firing? Yep, they're firing. Good. They're dead. Okay. Okay, savages should be able to deal with that. For the moment, the fortune of battle goes our way. Let's pray it remains as such. Hey, they just find them up on the walls near all these towers. That's no problem. They're just gonna take insane losses to that. We can probably get you guys. And at the moment, you're making these towers fire. Stay here. Stay here. Let's stretch out and see if we get both of those. Like this, we will smash the enemy. Yeah, they're gonna break there, that's for sure. Are you killing the Dunedain? You see, Joe? I am. I'm killing the Dunedain. All of them. They're all dying. In fact, well, they started it. Yeah, they, they definitely started it. Will be ours. Look how good these blade masters look there with their upgraded armor. They are fine. The enemy are badly bloodied. They have lost half their men. So died to a blister bolt to the back of the head. Most, the most oppressive thing about stakes is you got to remember where you put them yourself. That's the most important thing. There we go. Oh, they they rallied, they rallied, they rallied. Come back, come back, come back, come back, come back. Come back. Shoot him! Shoot him! How are we going? This unit's... That unit's no longer there. This unit's almost gone. It's okay. They've done their job. This one's still looking real healthy. Now still firing on this side. The imperialistic Dunedain aggressors. This is it. Don't ever forget it. Shoot him. They're routing. Run them over. Back over here, keep these towers firing. This one's still firing. I mean, we barely even got to the second layer. Kind of got over here. To me, Hillman. That was about it. We've got our archers here to fire it and it actually makes it through. 
which at the moment is like nothing. Okay, keep keep these towers going. Come down here. Your number two favorite faction. Yeah, next next campaign will be good again. And there is plans in the next, um, I want to say next, like, four campaigns, next four or five campaigns, to do a um, an Arnor Dunedain. So, if you're up for the Dunedain, it will be happening again soon. Maybe some Arnorian, uh, Arnorian Dunedain flavor coming. Not going to do another Reunited Kingdom, because that's just friggin', that's just brutal. Um... Very much in our favor. Victory will be ours. Kill him. Okay, what do we got left? Oh, they're bringing up their secondary ram. Oh, you want to bring up a secondary ram, do you? Okay. Can we come over here and just activate these towers? One there. One down here. Come over here. These ones going. And you can probably shoot them. Okay, that's good. Get back inside. Very good. Leave I leave Gondor to deal with themselves. Yeah. Those turns that took one hour, it was more than that. It was entire entire streams that took took like one turn. After you know, after taking after reuniting with Gondor. I mean it was cool at all, but far out. It like from a human point of view playing the game. It's exhaustive. It's exhaustive because everything is just battles. It's non-stop battles. Um, and you just got to push and push and push and push. And you make so much ground, obviously, because you got all these troops that Gondor give you, basically, when you uh, when you link up with them. But uh, it is just exhaustive um, to, to do that. Okay, so we've got... Some more lads coming through to the second layer. Um, good luck to them. Range is there. Uh, well, activate our trap card. Uh -huh. And we've now got archers here. Good luck with that, fellas. Yeah. Yeah, secondary layer. This is not even fair. Those. Oh, it's burning. It's burning. Oh, it's so brutal. Oh, it's so brutal. What do you do to that? Oh, it's disgusting. Oh, it just started burning. I gotta get the third. Well, we're not gonna let this one, these guys get out. Um, anyone, anyone here? Anyone left? Yeah, no, you're not, you're not getting out. Um, <laughs> gee, this, this is disgusting. Okay. Oh, you guys want to come back for more? Okay. Where 
Where are they at? Okay, get him. Okay, get him, fellas. Just go run him down. Morning, Baron Killer. Like this, they both fell at once. Smash the enemy. Nice. Realize one of the reasons it was so tough. Are, are you talking about the Reunited Kingdom campaign? Um, if you're playing normally, you'd strategically take settlements to eliminate enemies and minimize enemy your border settlements. But obviously, the, the AI doesn't do that. So when you take over, down. you have a million border settlements and no enemies eliminated. Um, no, it's not so much that. It's more that they don't have. Um, they don't go bankrupt. Um, that's that's more to the point. Uh, and that when they they get like a base income each turn, so they never they never go into the red, so they can just always keep recruiting troops. So when you take over, all of those troops they've recruited, when technically they should have been in the red, um, come home to roost. And so then it's just um, a ton of upkeep that you got to deal with. Now you could just disband units. This is a clear victory. But um, or you can just use those units to to go take a million settlements. Which is what I did, which means you just had like 10 to 15 turns of just nothing but battles constantly using all the soldiers you had. Um, but, uh, you know, that just gets a bit of battle fatigue. And towers just destroyed them there. We, we killed barely anything. Like, look at the con- like, what's this? 100, 200, uh, 300, 400, 500, 600, 700, like 700? They lost 2,408. <laughs> uh, I guess we captured a few. We, we captured a few routing ones as well. So let, let's say we got rid of like a thousand. It's like a thousand four hundred to the towers. Yeah. Okay. How's it going? Well, I've just discovered, for the first time ever in DAC, a settlement that has two layers. Um, which I was shocked to see. Used it to destroy the enemy, but was shocked to see it. Weren't they already sieging this? Well, now they are. No, it was, it was Ostul they were sieging. Crow's, crow's nest. We stand vigil as the enemy surrounds us. Ah, oh, well, Minas Tirith, I guess. Yeah. Um, I don't really count that, because that's that's custom. Um, Anuminas doesn't have two layers. It only has one layer. I mean, I mean actually, two, two walled layers. Like, there's no second gate on Anuminas. There's only the one gate. Even when it's rebuilt, right? Even when it's rebuilt, it's only got the one gate? I thought it only had the one gate, even when it was rebuilt. I could be wrong about that. I so rarely played on the rebuilt um, Anuminas, but but as a as a um, just a standard settlement, not not custom, just a standard settlement with two layers. I did not think they existed in DAC. I thought they were all removed. So I don't know whether that's like purposeful that this one in particular has that layer. Um. Or whether it's just like a holdover. They never changed the settlement. And it's just still the old the old type. I don't know. So, this is where we need to spend... Let's not spend any money. This is where we need to spend money. Right? We lost a... Bra we lost a, a... Oh, no. We lost one. Dang it. That's not good. Um, so... Merge those. Retrain those. And then... I guess another arch is not a bad idea. Then we just need some infantry. What's their melee stats? 3 and 6? 2 and 9? Get some infantry. Hmm. 
Maybe they felt like it had to be an easily defendable position. Yeah, maybe. Maybe. Um, but odd still. Very odd. Uh, so that means they didn't attack us here. They're still sieging. Yeah. I will only address you. How many rams do you guys need? Right. Let's reassess the situation after that turn. Uh, we still have more troops coming through. Do we have a decent amount here? Look at everything we've got together. Yeah, I think we're just waiting for these these generals to come yes, down and we'll send them with an army. Um, so... I'm gonna stick you! Honestly, we'll probably just go and attack that with the Witch King's army. So... Your will, my lord. My lord. Yeah. Orders. And now, can you guys just sit in yes, there? My lord. Save some money. By your command. Yes. Orders. By your command. Right there. Okay. Laying in wait for the enemy. And we'll my put lord. together an army with these two generals. Your orders, my lord. Not recruit any more troops, we gotta just deal with what we got. How the gobbler's doing? Ah, bad I see. Good. Uh, we had a big battle here. Big battle over Ananarod. Um, over 6,000 goblins. Uh, and uh, the Witch King came out on top. What's this? This is a faction here. Is this a faction leader? Hmm. Goblins are you. one of the factions I have managed to register a few times. More than once. I'm sure they've got quite a few generals around. But, um, Your will, my lord. Yeah. Orders. There's, I don't think there's really anything more we can do here. We, we're getting the troops, we're training troops. Yeah, that's just, we'll be what it'll be. We're going to get a barracks next turn, so we'll get access to more troops there. Just in time as well, honestly. Probably retrain those two. Uh, everything else behind is still just chugging along. We have 1400 gold. What do we want to spend 1400 gold on? Something that will make me money. <laughs> that's that's the reality. Something back here. No. Building. Yeah, mark it up and running there. Cobbledron? Yeah, there we go. Mark it. Nice. Let's get that. Athlon's almost at grade. Such a good player feels... Yeah, so am I, Juicy Joe. I, I love good factions, but I make myself play the evil faction. And you know what? I'm glad I have. Because I've really enjoyed some of the evil faction campaigns. Dunlum was really fun. Um, Isengard was pretty fun. This has been really good. Um, the... Um, Dol Guldur, I really didn't think I would enjoy, but uh, Kamul was incredibly fun to use. Um, I mean, if it wasn't for him, it'd probably be a pretty dull campaign, but he was, he, and, and the two, um, wraiths that you get. Uh, Rune is, uh, Rune's okay. I don't, I don't really count Rune as an evil faction, really. They are evil faction, but they, they're basically human. They're a human faction. Um, Harad was fun. You know, we'd get the Muma kill out and all the different trollman warriors and stuff. Like, they were a bunch of fun. Ardenheim was a bunch of fun. Like, I really do love my good factions, but there's... I've certainly enjoyed evil factions a lot more than what I thought I would. Um, yes. So I'm glad I have played them. The ones I'm most tentative about I still haven't done, which is Goblins and Mordor. We are going to do them, but they are we certainly coming last on the list. <laughs> They're coming last on the list. Right, anything that of trouble here, the only concern is the Warg Pack, so if we can kill them... Everything else is garbage. Right? There is nothing else of concern here. It's just the Warg Pack. Um, there's not even any Black Pit units. There's a lot of Uruk Overseers. Show no mercy. We, got, we got rid of all the dangerous units in that last battle, hopefully. At least most of them. 
I wish Angmar had one more unique building or something. Yeah, I did say that. I have noted that that there's no there's no special industry they get, which I think is fine. I think there's that they have enough going for them. Often, the position of a faction dictates a lot more than even what they can do. And Angmar's position, I guess Gundabad and Angmar are fairly similar, but Gundabad and Angmar, I think, have very different campaigns. Like, both different sides, like, very different enemies. Uh, let's get rid of that walk back and then we can kill the rest. Uh, that was a hill, yep. But in terms of position, they're pretty unique in that they're they're up in that northern area with Angmar, like Angmar's campaign. There's there's not really an evil faction anywhere else near them. Goblins would be the next closest. But, uh, you can just hang back. Uh, you can kind of go with them. You not be so. You know, there's not many of you, so just stay a little thinner. And then let's just have some trash on the front lines. Some of them. Um, really have a lot of trash. In fact, I barely have much front line in this army. A lot of my front line, di I guess, died in that big battle. Yeah. A lot of my front line did die. Uh, and then I'll just keep the Iron Crown units kind of in reserve. Anything else left over here? I think that's it. Yeah, so then you... Jamishers, and then Cab Archers, like that. Okay, where are those warm pack? That's them over the other side, isn't it? Then once they go down, then we're, we're free to do whatever we want. We'll just leave the army where it is. Um, right over here. Hold fire. Speed things up. I think they're going to try and take some high ground or something. I'd like to get around to them while they're still moving. Yeah, just get around onto this flank. I know it's not great with all the trees, but um, go get over here and shoot these back. You stay, honestly, over here. Because I reckon they're going to charge this direction once we... You just stay over here. I reckon once we deal with... Start shooting them, they'll, they'll start coming towards their infantry. Where are we at? No, don't shoot them. This is the target here. Come all the way around. Keep going, keep going. Nice and close. Okay, starting to get close. Okay, and fire it, we'll fire it, we'll fire it. We'll pull back, pull back, pull back. Shoot him, shoot him, shoot him. Take him out, take him out, take him out. Keep moving, keep moving up the hill. Oh, they've come back, come back. Yeah. Shots coming down 90. Flanking us. That's nice. him, keep shooting him. Going around. I actually wanted to protect their damn wolf pack. Shim, 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 shim. The battle is very much in our favor. Victory will be ours. Get rid of him. Get rid of him. Get rid of him. Come on. 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 Have we got them charging. Can we pull back now? They should run away from their infantry. Keep shooting him, keep shooting him. You two are out of ammunition, can you move out of the way? Over here. Keep going, keep going. Where are they going? Did we get them all? I thought there was a couple left still. I think they're mostly gone. 
moving. I think they're moving. Yeah, they're moving towards our main army now. The swing, you swing back around and reconnect with the Witch King. Okay, down this hill. Okay, there's a cup. I think there's probably only a couple left, so I think we did pretty well. Swing back over to here. All right, you can start charging pretty much anything now. Get archers start firing. Can you sit this flank? Something here. Slow things down. Okay, you lads get back to this ridge line here. In we go. Goodbye, Snagger. This will follow Flip. Flip Cono, welcome in. Thanks for the follow. Get over there. Archers are going to have Adam. Very much in our favor. Oh Victory yeah. Victory will be ours. Witch King is going to love today. Let him have some more. Oh, some archers don't care. Goblin archers. What are they going to do to me? What are they going to do to the Witch King? There was 252 goblin infantry, and there's now yeah, 100. Try right, again. They on hold. Yep. Good. Sergeant, where is those goblins that were coming from that flank yet? So I reckon we can what we do here is almost just go for like a big alpha charge here. So if we can go like into there, into there, here, into here, go for like a huge charge down this hill. In with this at the same time. Around their back almost him on this flank. I reckon we can route almost everything here. And then come around the back. Yep. In we go. In we go. In we go. Cut him off. Cut him off. Cut him off. Yep. Beautiful. Beautiful route. Excellent. 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 Only excellent. Half the enemy force remains. Kirk Overseer is not going to route. It's a bit of a pain. Pushing through. Oh, that's good. Yeah, that's that's a. It was good. It was good indeed. Pull over here. Pull over here. Over this other hill. Pull over as well. Oh yeah, that that um that did the job. Archers, what are you firing at? Shoot, shoot these guys standing still here. Off, finish him off. Okay. Nice charge. Good stuff. Yay. Alright, who's next? Goblin archers. You want some? Now, I don't know if I need to use any more wargs now. Let's see how much they got left. Goblin bo oh, bodyguards. Shoot at them. over him. Goblin band. Let's get around here. Stay in. I reckon we can route these guys in from the rear at the same time. What do we got? Eric Overseers. Okay, can one of you go with Goblin Infantry? One hit the Eric Overseers. One hit these ones from behind it. I mean, it's, just, it's just Goblin Band. This should be fine. In there, go, go, go. Yes, then. Okay, run them over. Good. Okay, Eric Overseas will, once again, they'll hold a little longer, so probably don't stay in against them, but everything else here should be out. The band's actually holding surprisingly well. Then move again, and again, go, go. Walk back. Archers, switch targets to these Eric Overseers. Then from the rear, they should now go. Get over to this one, Snake of Stalkers. Okay. Yep. 
Witch King in the, in the rear there. Yep, they were out. Excellent. There we go. Carry the charge through onto those ones. And send them packing as well. On the other side. Give them a touch. Yep, good stuff. Okay, where are you two at? Over here. I have one of you just to go deal with that. Archers are out of ammunition. Alright, you charge in. Let's go. In there. In from the rear. The craven enemy flees from the battle. The enemy army flees the field. Pursue and run them down. Finish them off. There's a general here somewhere. Where is he? There he is. There he is. Kill him. Not getting away from me. You just run off with your other goblins. Thought I'd let you get away, eh? Not today. The high chief lug. We have to lug your body back. As proof of death. Or we could just burn you. We'll just burn you. This is a clear victory. Yeah, that was a that's a nice victory. 669 kills on, on the Witch King. Guardians of Kandum unit. And 339 prisoners caught. That's over a thousand. Over a thousand just from the Witch King this battle. Horses. And only three Guardians died. Yeah, two healed. Um, so only one no, in the end, yeah. <laughs> and one of them was Friendly Fire. Oh. Yeah, as I said, that goblin army, once we got rid of the warg the warg pack, was just a was just a run over. That's why I just focused used pretty much most of my ammunition from my um from my cav to get rid of that warg pack. And once it's gone, the rest was just a was just a clean up. Forces are well hidden. The trap is set. <laughs> Victory! <laughs> Victory! That's great. <laughs> so this guy's the faction heir. Oh, that's the um. I'm gonna stick you. Uh, we can get rid of him. Who became the faction leader? Someone else. Some other schmuck. Um, so... Order. Orders, my lord. All of you jump back into there. Yes. Yes. No I should here. have enough movement to get there and get back. An you don't order. need to go. Split your will, my lord. You're gonna kill the dwarves of Moria too? Oh yeah, in in due time. They will they will die. They will die. One of the, normally the one of the easiest wars to do because they just have the one settlement. To war then. Victory in your have a taste of my blade. Are we gonna do the old the old assassinate and run? I'm gonna stick you! That's what we're gonna do. By your command. Depends on what's in the secondary army. We could probably kill them as well. We bring the battle to the enemy. <laughs> Good. Good morning, Kirikoska. Welcome in. First time chat. Lovely to have you here. So we'll just see how things are going. We can assassinate this this general and then if we have enough ammunition left we can take out the halberds and then run over the rest of the, the other troops the enemy have brought up more men so yeah just just let's go let's deal with him now there should be a similar speed because they're wargs as well they are melee wargs or ranged lads All the good mornings in your evening? Yeah, that's okay. That's okay. Up 
Pull them back. Yeah, they're gonna start Our running. Okay, okay. To be gaining the upper hand in this okay, okay. Run, 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 run. Up and over the hill, up and over the hill, up and over the hill. Okay, okay. okay. Oh, okay. Shoot him, shoot him, shoot him, shoot him. Keep running, keep running, keep running. Keep running. Don't, don't stop, don't stop. Keep going, keep going, keep going. Don't, don't fight. They fight better than you. I mean, we could just, I guess, surround them, but there's still 60 of them. They'll, they'll take their pound of flesh. I'd rather shoot them. Why are you guys not firing? Oh, you know what? Just get in there. Just get in there. Go, go, go. Fight, 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 fight. Bear lamb. Surely you should just overwhelm them with numbers here and take them out. I would think. I would think. But, you know. I'm in the rear. Half the enemy force remains. Yeah, we're losing a lot. Surely, come on. We're like, completely surround them all. They should go down. You would think. I have seen the expanded unit roster for version 5. Um, and I'm not currently interested in it. Wow, we are losing so many troops here. This is why I didn't want to engage. Uh, okay. We hire up and kill them, perhaps? I don't think we're going to be staying around to kill the other. That must be the general. Do they have any range units? Yeah. yeah, let's just do the old assassinate and run. Draw them. That didn't go as well as I'd liked. If we'd shot him, it would have been fine, but um, apparently completely surrounding the unit, we lost so many walks. Gee. This defeat is a bitter drop defeat. to swallow. Defeat. Next it's okay. Be Killed him. That sups from this kind of funny. Ah, oh, it doesn't disturb me at all. You know, it is kind of funny. Kirikoska's actual question of, have you seen the ex the expended unit roaster? We can go no further today. <laughs> That's a little bit funny. All right, did you come back to here? Excellent. Good. Now, do we have a warg center here? No, let's, let's get that happening so we can retrain some lads. All right, so that's another, another one of theirs out. Taste of my blade. Right. How's that go for money? 13,000 next turn. We lost a lot of troops this turn. <laughs> we lost a lot of troops. I think last turn we made 3,000 gold. So that's a significant increase. I'm going to go with. Yes, my lord. They're just still mucking around. Eating us there. Now, how is. How is old mate Sauron? He's not concerned with us fighting the goblins. He might he might send us a little Pope message soon. Tell us to stop being naughty. It would also be funny if the goblins just got regicided. No, they've got um that was the faction heir. They've still got a faction leader somewhere. <clears throat> Probably sitting in Kazadoom or somewhere else. I don't know. But it would be funny. It would be funny if if somehow a faction died by losing their faction heir and and still having a faction leader alive. That that would be funny. You are correct. I'm not going to deny that one. That is a true statement. Yes, my lord. As you wish. Without question, I shall continue tomorrow. Yeah, I think it updates. Was that herbalist just for our, for our friend? No.
We got Mox of War as well, that's nice. Okay, so I kinda see an opportunity here. Yes. I'm gonna stick you. The problem with this opportunity is although we could win it, we're then bordering a full stack of dwarves, which we wouldn't have the strength to defend against. Um and we'd still be bordering down here. So although we could we could take that right now, um, I'm just cautious of what could be. And I don't want to end up in a situation where I've got my Witch King um, trapped in a settlement that we can't defend An against order. a greater force. Also, how is the public order like him out? Yes. Okay, so we can actually move him out. We train his numbers, sure. We have to probably go around and do some building again. So we've got cash. Your will, my lord. We're almost caught up with these two generals. Orders, my lord. Orders. Yes. March to exhaustion. Continuing later. No one. Gundabad has not come over. That's good for us. Wargs. Uh, also down here. Uh, where are they? These ones. Those. These are the lads we need if we're going to fight the um the dwarves, right? Th these ones. Um, like this this tier aren't going to do anything. These will be okay. Like let's queue them up. But um, yeah, Angmar and infantry will just get will just get eaten up by dwarves. They're still sieging. Come and get me, you coward. Is this like bugging out at this point? Why are they not Come and get me, you coward. Why are they not attacking? I got wargs in here? Just the one. I will only address you in battle. Don't really like fighting these these armies on the open field with so many archers. They just kind of blow us away. Because a lot of our troops are either no shields or very low armor. Or low armor and no shields. Combination of the two. Train those. Come on again. And don't need another archer. I think we do want though the wall camp here. Keep going. Maybe Hillman camp, because we've got a lot of pikes. And then over here, Brunost. Something gives some money. Yes, my lord. Almost there. Your will, my lord. That's tempting. Very, very tempting to go for this. What's what's down here? Lord, approaching quietly. Have a taste of my blade. The nothing army. Approaching. Um, where he goes. I shall continue tomorrow. I think what we'll do is we'll get moving with with this attack. Pretty garbage troops, isn't it? I'm just relying on numbers, which is what the goblins do better than us. Um. Listen up. As you wish, my lord. Your will, my lord. Orders. My lord. By your command. Joining forces, my lord. Get ready for fighting. Your will, my lord. My lord. Archers, check them in. Merging armies, my lord. Your will, my 
my lord. My lord. Joining forces, my lord. Your will, my lord. Are you your will? You jump into there, you go to there. Yeah, so we'll get this army going down to try and take Osynthiel. No Trying an alliance with Kazadoom? I don't want an alliance with Kazadoom. Um, I'm gonna kill him. My lord. Approaching quietly. Approaching quietly. Approaching and my diplomats are not, uh, not anywhere to be seen there. A little bit too far away for that anyway. Yes, my lord. That, spend our money at least. Okay. I hope they attack here. They're starting to annoy me fairly significantly that they haven't gone in. Also, taking uh, Olegian is going to open us up to the the Northern Dunedain on this front. They'll be able to attack us down here at from Tharbad and from Tehuen. So. Just something else to consider that we do need like a, a good chunk of soldiers to, to take this, just because we need to be able to defend it as well. Okay, let's see what sort of defenses we have here then. Got a couple of garrison troops. It's the faction air. They got three siege equipment, a lot of spears. Two Arthurine footmen, they're the only real things they're going to hit hard in melee. Everything else is fairly easy to deal with. Uh, I guess the, the, gen the general, but yeah, the three of them. Do we have wargs? We got three ourselves. Hmm. Okay, let's see what settlement type we're dealing with, and then we'll decide whether we're going to sally out and try and deal with the. Two cav. Are we gonna try and deal with the ballistas or not? We march into battle. Hundred twelve turns should be nicely built up. Kaz Doom. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. <laughs> it's gonna be it's gonna be a nice settlement for us. Probably be our richest settlement. So. We do have towers, but I feel like they're going to all be gone by the time... <laughs> okay. It's the ram. It's the ram conga line. They've got a few of them. I think we just defend at the capture point. Because these towers are probably going to get destroyed by all the siege equipment. These walls are not very good for hiding behind with, with their archers anyway. Um, I think we just pull back to here. And play a bit of a channel, let them let them funnel down the center point and shoot them a little bit. Although we only have one archer, yeah. and because they'll go around the edges, then we can actually use some towers that aren't destroyed by all the siege equipment. Yeah, there's going to be too many breaches here to deal with anyway, uh, with the three pieces of siege. So we'll just fall back. You don't like defending this type of settlement? Yeah, it's, it's there. I don't like them that much. There's obviously better options, but um, you just got to work with what you got. You can't always just play the same way uh, for every settlement type. So this one, particularly with what they're bringing, it's going to be much better for us just to kind of fall back and defend the center. They have all of them there. They're all our archers. Uh, you, you're going to kind of be here. Front row. I don't really care if you die. But just throw your javelins first. Okay. And then... Pikes. You know, go up the flanks. On that. Almost like how we were defending, um... <laughs> defending the... The watchtower at Osul. Now, these two will definitely be in amongst the mix pretty early. Maybe more back here. Mm. I don't know. 
I definitely do want to leave the channel, but I don't have that many archers, so it's not that important. In fact, I, don't, I probably don't need the full channel. Um, as long as we just hold them in this section and then kind of just surround them when they come in, it's fine. Remember, they mainly just have spears. So, what we want to do is have a couple of thralls because they might send cav around the edge. Um, just to stand here, basically. Activate these towers, but also... I want to stand below the lip here because if they send their cav archers around... They won't be able to shoot down here very well, and the towers will hit them in the back. So go like that, and then on this side, half the bullet is. Um, hmm, that's not as good. It is not as good. I just put them here, and then have like a hillman over here. So we have a little bit of a surround there. Because we don't want to get a pikeman hit in the back. Um, is, is the key thing here. And then just have you fellas kind of in here. Ready to go in when needed. Uh, we've got another hillman. You over here. Get you ready when needed. Um, we got some generals. Which I'm going to put at the back. Uh, probably even stand sideways and stand with your flank general on the flank. Okay. And then what else we got left? Angmar and infantry. The fellas. Yeah, just uh, just hang out over here for now. One on the side. Probably be back here, and then you can come up the middle. One there, and one here. Alright, and then I'll be pushed up the middle once we're done with the archers. Yeah, and we just let them, let them kind of shoot their artillery at us here, and not get any real value out of it. So we want those pikes to be pretty thick. We don't want them to be overwhelmed. We also don't want them getting shot. Alright. Javelins. Come forward a little bit. You two are going to be behind. Ready to get stuck in pretty quickly. Hey. Archers. How you Mofus doing? Boy. Hey. How you doing? I'm, uh, I'm doing pretty well. We're enjoying our multi-front war. Enjoying everyone trying to kill us. And us trying to kill them. It's all very mutual. Right up against these walls. Uh, it's probably not too bad. I go like that. That's good. Alright, in case anything runs all the way around, just for now, I'll have others kind of like that. Yeah. Uh, now we do have these ones holding this, these towers. Now, in experience, when you do it, defend this way, normally they don't spend send that many um, troops around the flanks, but they will send a few. Uh, so you just got to have a, a couple of lads, just basically there, just to hold them, hold them in place. Uh, yeah. Have your shields facing that way because that's the way it's going to get shot at. Yeah. Awesome, love catching you again. <laughs> awesome. Catching you love a, a gay on. Love again. Oh my god, live. How <laughs> far into the stream? Uh, we are 2049 or about 2015 into the stream. Uh, so you have caught us towards the end of the end of the stream today. Fight on. They must get no further. More halt. Oh, the wargs. Warg Start a howl. Get everyone howling. Long living live, Bofa's boy. <laughs> yeah, that's it. 
Just, just give it to him. Let him know that his that his his autocorrect is not doing him doing him justice. Yeah. So defending at the gates here is just not is just not viable. They're gonna have too many um ways to get around us, and as well we'd be taking casualties from um, catapults and ballistas and stuff right now. Okay. Yep, just use it, that's okay. Um, yeah, they're going for the towers now? Yeah, this is what I thought. So the, the one advantage we would have of defending there, the towers, are gonna be are gonna be gone. So what are they going for? These towers? Out of ammunition? Oh good. Good, good. So the towers still would have been up, but still. I think I think this plan is better. It's a lot more controlled. Because you're gonna have to funnel in through here. Um, and that means that they won't get as decent shots at our um at our pikes. Hopefully. Get ready for fighting. Okay, when they're in range, let them have it. Yep, I know. And throw it, throw it, throw it, throw it, throw it. Through, through, through. Uh, archers start firing. Who's, who's the next one here? Oh, they're already firing them. Fire. Fire, 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 fire. The enemy have Take the them out. These guys are probably some of the more dangerous units because they'll fire whilst standing there. Now, at least they're standing still. They are shooting us. Basically. We are, we are dishing it back out to him. Shooting him. Get ready for fighting. Throw. Last nice couple of javelins. Okay. You fellas are fine to get in because you're getting shot anyway, so you may as well get in there. Um. Yeah, you guys honestly just. Taking too many casualties. They're facing forward with shields. Pray something changes in the course of battle for defeat. And eleven. Okay, it's not going to be firing that many, unless there are other ranges firing now as well, which they are. Mm, that's a problem. Okay, we just need to get in. They're, they're just going to get shot to pieces. They get in. Uh, okay, anything come around the flanks? There has been. Okay, so what do we got? Real militia. That's fine. Over here. What do we got? Dunedine Wardens. We've got towers firing in their back, so that should tip it in our favor a little bit. Anything else moving around the flanks? No. Okay, so everything else is sort of coming up the middle. There's a Arthurdine Footman. It's good that it's not in amongst the mix right now. Isn't really going how I wanted it to go. I'm kind of pushing in now, so that's good. Archers, keep shooting these. These rangers. So what I would like then is get you over here. Kind of get around on their archers. That's not put them there. At least they're not shooting them. They're hidden by buildings a little bit. Let's let that happen slowly. Towers will get more kills the slower the fight goes. Uh, we're still keeping ones in reserve. Right, you, could you shoot? This is why I wanted a bit of a channel. Which we may still get here because they're kind of pushing in pretty hard. That was looking at back. That's mainly garbage. Get over there. Do you have any special abilities? You do. I, mean, I think that's not a bad time to pop that right now. Permanent fatigue reduction, a little bit of combat effectiveness, we'll take it. Okay, now I think as well on this side, we could send around a unit. It's fun. Around. Archers are out of ammunition. So I want you to pull back so you don't get shot. Back to here. Alright. We got rid of most of the archers. There's a few there still. This is coming around after my footman. Yeah, we haven't finished this off as fast as what I would have liked. Bit of a shame. 
spot. We can then counter flank them with this unit. Get you around here as well. Come forward. Okay, all we gotta do is hold them in here. There is other than sensors that we should get fire at those. in there that's good keep moving around okay, so we've now got the counter flank on us here it's not good but if we then counter flank their counter flank they're routing okay so they're fighting to that that's good go check to just rest for a second how are you going on your fatigue you're tired yeah just give a chance to rest these lads are still fresh we can then get on their flank fight them. That should do good. I'll just keep holding them here. Getting some shots off. Get just into the back there. That's nice. They're firing up and over at these lads, which means they're not going to get good kills. Now's the time to run. While well, these guys are still holding. Back and past. Okay. Then into their flank. Yep, just keep shooting in there. As long as we're just shooting into the back, we won't get many friendly fire kills. Come down a little bit more. Yeah. Take that flank, you can do it. I reckon I could actually. You go around. You're almost out of ammunition. You'll be able to go as well in a second. Head in on their flank. Book fighters should do pretty well against the spearmen. Yeah. You're done. Out you go. You now step up. Next one up to the plate. Now we still got a couple of units on the flanks just holding. We're kind of hoping they engage mainly on the pikes here. Okay. Holding fellas. All right, now if we can just fire into, where are you at? Yep. You fire into the back. Yeah, aim, aim at the back there. How are we going? Yep, shooting mainly over the heads of our lads. See where those, see where the shots are coming in. They have lost half yep, their men. towards the back. Yeah, that's a little bit more towards the back though. Go for that one, yeah. Yep, that's good. Okay. Now where are my two wargs that I've sent around? You, over you come. Where are you? Around you go. How are we going here? Yeah, we've almost beaten that flank. You shoot the dude and bodyguards. There's a bit of a bit of a little nice spot there for you to shoot into. Shoot those bodyguards. Try and take them out. Okay, how are we going over here? Yeah, we've almost collapsed this flank as well. Yeah, there's more coming. Rangers and catapult crew, okay. This fight is not going quite how I would have liked. Oh shit, there's still, there's still ammunition. Go, 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 go. Take him out, take him out. For the moment, the fortune of battle goes our way. Let's take these out while we have a chance. Remains as such. Oh, yeah. Take him out, take him out. Pull back again. Okay, how are we going? How are we going in the center? Yeah, getting good kills. Targeting that dude on bodyguard. Yeah. Okay. I think what we're gonna start to do is start moving these guys over. They need some more punching power again. Get over here. Take him out. Whoa, 
Okay, they're out of ammunition, so now we want to hit them with the armor-piercing lads that are fresh. You're done. Get around their flank, right around the back, and don't let them escape. They're going the way I want them to. Yeah, they're running around. Good. Okay. Get in there. Get in there. Okay, nice. Pikes are doing a really good job just holding them in place. That's what we wanted them to do. We can't get them pushed back a little bit, but that's fine. Alright, so they're going to come around. Push them off. They've come back to protect their friggin... You've got ammunition. Can you just kill them? Run them over. Okay, how are we going out over on this flank? I imagine not as well. How are you guys? You're winded? Okay, so what I want to do is kind of let a... Let them out a little bit and then flank them with the next two. Just let these fight because fighting into this is not positive for us. Okay. Yeah. Now, if we can get into the back of them and just let loose with some volleys, that'll be excellent. Because they're not going to rout yet without the general dead. So charging in some exhausted troops in the back at the moment is not going to really do a whole lot. Particularly when they're low tier trash. So we just got to just keep wearing them down. You're done with ammunition, right? Yeah. Uh, if we continue over like there. this, we will smash the enemy. Now, what we do now is we pull these two fellas up. Been close to the fight in case we need him. Start walking forward. What's running? Whoever that is, kill him. Okay, nice and close. And now point blank into their back. Here we go. Good. Not a lot of them, but that'll still get a nice number of kills. All right, very tight. I want you just to walk forward. Just walk forward. What's happening over here? Yeah. I wanted to commit to either of these sides, so then we can hit charge them in the rear with the with the other unit. Walk up. I think time for another one of those. It's in order. The savages are really cutting through what we wanted. We want to save our, our better unit till the end. Show them might. Now their general should be in here somewhere. There's 18 of them left. Yeah. A legion of the hills. Rolls over it. We'll keep shooting into them, yep. Keep letting them have it. Shots in the back are worth twice as many as shots in the front. around here as well to be a oh hold up what's going on here do nine rangers yeah we got catapult crew Kate's them okay uh can you just come a little further up can we hit him with the wargs okay, fight 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 the wargs here and then we can charge in Towers are firing, which is probably going to kill more of our troops than theirs, because I'm going to run them with wolves here. Let's take for a, run. Got a little bit of ammunition left. Keep that. Keep those shots firing. Then give it to them. We might be able to route this unit. If not, we can just cycle charge it and get some kills. Try again. Try again. Yeah, that was pretty good. Again, how are we going with this ballista crew? It's almost done. Adipot crew, whatever it was. Good. Yeah. They're out of ammunition. Uh, General's not yet died. Back. Hoping to get these guys a little fresher, but that's not going to happen. Let's try again. Okay, 
Come up. The Witch King is behind us. Second. A legion of the hills. Outrun. Second. Same with everything. That's the general that. Very good. Around him, hopefully. Hold on, lads. Well done. Vanquished. Heal. Good this amount. is a great victory worthy of only the mightiest of generals. Very nice. Pikeman 243 and 179. Yes, yeah, so they did exactly what they needed. Just hold them in place. Um, waiting for the chance to uh, the other lads to get the job done. That was pretty rough though. Um, we had defenders back. Uh, did get a bit of healing on other units. Man, tell you what, these battles against Dunedain armies where I don't have a clear strategic advantage is uh, uh, tiringly bad. And I, I don't mean tiring for me playing it because that was pretty fun, but tiring for my armies because we're going to run out of troops. Killmen and Thralls just don't cut it. <laughs> That's the end of the day. They just don't cut it against Dunedain units. No, now that's a general on his lonesome. We can kill him. Money in the bank though feels good. Uh, is it this turn I can get another general recruiting? It is. Okay. Probably want the Angmar. Uh, I can get Angmar and infantry a lot closer. I'm not going to pay for upkeep for them to move all the way down. Okay, keep Your orders, my moving lord. them. With honor, we shall have the new nine rebuild new mass yet? No, they haven't. They have not. They've been slack. By your Slackers. Will, my lord. Okay, you're going to here. To war then. Bring some of those. Gulsevered Luan and Northern Dunedain have ceased attacking. So hang on, who are they at war with anymore? Just the High Elves. Okay. They still didn't attack us here. I'm starting to feel like this is bugged. Why would they not have attacked? They have infantry. They have equipment. They're just not coming in. Train units. Orders. Okay. 
Okay. He's got a couple of lads with him. My mm, three wargs are pretty damaged. I probably don't want to actually kill him. I respect you. I, I would get the enemy. job done, I think, but we'd lose a lot. And my wargs are pretty important in my defense there at the moment. I don't want to just throw them away. I remember when I sent two war units against Let's a single general and we lost, um, almost lost the battle. Uh, so one, two fairly injured ones and one pretty good one I think would, might end up in trouble fighting that. So we'll just leave them go. They can, they can go on their way. There aren't any other ones, there's no one else around though. Can I get my infantry there? Could get an infantry unit there. All I need is one infantry to kind of distract them. While I charge him with the wolves. Hate letting generals get away. As you what we'll do is we'll do this. Marching to war. Right. Give them no quarter, they stay men. Take up arms and take You hope the goblins realize the mistake they have made? I hope they don't. <laughs> I don't think they're the very learning type. They're a, bit, a little bit slow on the uptake. And so what we're going to do is use these guys as, as some arrow fodder. And send the other two around to get the job done. That is true. Where are they at? Over here? Okay, so... Spread out. We want them shooting at them. In fact, if we could use all their ammunition on that thrall, that'd be fine. I really wouldn't care. Um, because then I could just go in and shoot them, shoot the rest of them with the, the wolves. This thrall unit is entirely expendable. I don't care about it at all. Because they... No back talk worms. No back talk worms. Pay attention, scum. Pay attention, scum. That's it. They're scum. They're worms. Don't care about them. Are they not in range yet? I'm sure they would be. I'm sure they would be. They're now being shot at, good. Both of them? Yep. Alright, you shoot at the you shoot at the worms. They are the goblin infantry replacement. Yeah. As long as they don't route, that'd be the only the bad thing. Keep using it. Use a lot of ammunition. They're like, Angmar, they've made a mistake. They've just sent some some thralls at us, sir. We'll shoot them, good lad. Shoot them all. Don't, don't you think they might have other units as well? Do you think that maybe they're just baiting us into using our ammunition so that some wolves can pop out from behind these hills and 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 kill us? I mean, look, sir. I see war. I see movement. That's just the trick of the snow, soldier. It's a trick of the snow. There's actually they kind of do blend in because they're white. The white wolves. It's just a trick of the snow, soldier. There's nothing there. Stop! Stop panicking. Ammunition. Nice. Still some ammunition left. Okay, now you're out. Okay. Bring the trap, lads. Spring it. Spring it hard. Oh, Rangers. Oh, you want these guys? No, nah, you don't get to have them. Oh, Rangers. Hey, how are ya? Now 
Nah, nah, you don't, you don't get these guys. They're out of here. They're running. I told them to run. Apparently not so. Enemy are badly bloodied. They have lost half their men. I mean, men. whatever. They're fighting. That's fine. They're just worms. It's okay. Their reward is they got to live a little longer. Okay, good. He's dead. dead. I was going to say, how long can he be alive for? Shoot him. Army, kill the field. Him. Don't kill your own wolves, though. Shoot them all. No one gets to hear of this strategy. No one gets to hear of this, the, uh, the thrall, thrall bait strategy. Like, just chase them. Yeah. By the victory no one gets to escape. Today. Very good. 20 of those thralls heal. I don't know how that's possible because anyone who was slightly injured on the ground we would have fed the wargs with. Friend or foe, really. Um, I think that, is, that 20, 20 healed is, is uh, incorrect data. Okay, you three can make it back. You lads, we're leaving out in the cold. Okay, if you make it back alive, it's on your own merits. It's on your own merits. That's it. I reckon we could get another Hillman as well. Just out, just out of interest there. Another unit wouldn't wouldn't go badly. Particularly if we're gonna have that type of defense. You know what? The ballista wouldn't be bad as well. I mean, yeah, if we have that ballista, wouldn't be bad to having that the central choke. Okay. Your will, my lord. Yes. One of them is going to go to here. One of them has herbless. The other one has one has herbless. The other one doesn't have anything. Hmm. Has he got anything yet here? No, we got the herbless here, haven't we? Yeah. Come on, give it to him. Give him some. Give him some traits. I'm gonna stick you. Uh, and then we need to spend some money. Where is going to make us the most money? Morvatarth. Be nice and safe. The growth for you. Yep. Sounds good. Mount Graham as well. Yep. Um, now the market. The Tash. Probably want to get the garrison here in case we have... You know what? That is going to get some free upkeep. That saves money. Yeah. A little bit of cash here and there. Alright. Hey. I think that's about where we're gonna call it for today. Um did Fog of War last time, so that's not today. <laughs> Typically I remember straight away for the day I don't need to do it. Um but uh, next time I have to see. I may need to sally out on this and try and deal with that. I have the feeling it's kinda of bugged and not not attacking. Because they've been sieging for a long time now and they haven't gone in. Uh, I'm a little bit concerned about how that would go. Because we don't have the best units. We've lost quite a few troops to attrition. Um, otherwise, I'm hoping next time we'll take Ossethiel, take Khazadum, get some generals down here, start getting some more money out of these settlements. Uh, get those healing traits on the Witch King. I really want to get them up. Uh, the three different healing... Well, the one trait and the two retinue. That he can really lead the armies very well. Um, and sort of control this area all down here. And then we'll just have more borders against the, <laughs> against the Dunedain um, and, and Bree. 
So that will be for next time. So I have these troops up in the north here. Where I'm going to send them. We're going to go to Gundabad, but Gundabad seems to have cooled. So we might send them over to Anumnas. Launch an assault on there. That might be next time as well. Anyway, um, if you're watching on YouTube, be sure to like, subscribe, comment, and share. And I'll see you in the next episode. Have a good one.